What's going on, y'all? Back with another reaction video today. We got Charleston Rambo. Hey, he gotta be he gotta be nice based off of that last name. Got to. Um, never heard of him, uh, never seen him, but definitely looking forward to watching the play today. Uh, six one one seventy seven four five seven. Uh, so I'm assuming slimmer frame receiver and six one one seventy. Um, Rambo played at Oklahoma for four seasons before transferring to the Hurricanes for 21. As a sooner, Rambo flashed in a rotation with a lot of talented receivers, but in Miami, he could be number one receiver for the Eric King. All right, has some speed and height, but could stand to fill out his frame for the NFL. Okay, so it's pretty wild. I made a comment on that already. Uh, next season, says Rambo was solid but unspectacular for Miami in 21. He had a slow time at the combine and that hurt him considering he's already underweight and thin for the NFL. Man, okay, all right. So Cedar Hill, Texas. I thought his name was familiar. Maybe that's where I seen him. Seen his name from before. Uh four, five, seven. Uh let's see, let's see. Overview. Round seven priority free agent. Oh wow. Okay. Uh this is a pro projection. Um says oh, slender wide out, lacking explosiveness, but making up for it with competitive physicality inside the route. Rambo runs routes with good tempo and crispness. His hands were better this year, but easy drops still plague him at times. He has a feel for how to compete with coverage near him. But the Alabama game was concerning as he appeared to lack the strength to deal with the firm press, man. Rambo has late day three potential and should give a good fight for a late roster spot or a place on a practice squad. Strength starter for three years at two schools. Uh, hit 90 yards receiving in every ACC game but one. Drives cornerback wide with a free inside release. So sounds like he's a good route runner. So that's always a plus. Uh, I, I say that uh, multiple times, you know. The two biggest things for receivers to work on is route running and catching. Just that simple. Everything else is uh, icing on the cake. You can catch. Your hands are consistent and you can run routes well and be deceiving and be deceptive with your routes. You good. You know what I mean? Um, drives cornerbacks wide to free and inside release consistently squares his quarterback aggressive hands swat away tight man coverage route turns and breaks come sharply patient and poised tracking the deep ball competitive runner after the catch weaknesses leggy release like suddenness press can take away his route can take his route way off schedule alabama cornerback stayed in his face all game carries lean frame and below average play strength disappointing contested catch success rate mm. Career tape filled with too many easy drops. Production bolstered by easy hitch screens. Oh, uh, 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 uh. All right, we're gonna see. We're gonna check them out. Uh, probably not gonna watch the whole thing. It's ten minutes. Uh, probably will just watch a few minutes, and then uh, I got a lot, a lot of videos to react to. So we'll be on to the next. A little hitch right there. Real quick, I'm gonna just see if I can find a shorter one. Y'all just give the patient with me. Oh, well. Tight end Will Mallory, six foot five. He's got a height advantage. King swings it to the outside. Here's Rambo getting free along the sideline. That's going to be another first down. He's pushed out by Trey Cobb. Third down and five. Pierre King looking for Rambo on the out route. Makes the catch, and that's a first down for the King. Pressure coming off the edge. King is hit. Got rid of it, and he fouls. Great sideline catch. Get the great, great. In. Got two. Absolutely. Good job, man. Took a Pick up the pressure and completion on the run. Got another hitch. Again, they pick up the pressure and a good strike to mm, Rambo definitely like, on the near side. He's been through. I definitely like using him for those. King now on first down, and he gets this the out route. Just what he went through and watching his mom, but that difficult stretch. Most individuals would never have to go through. And now he's finding mm, rhythm. The move. And here goes Rambo. And a lot of comebacks, and, and he got a screen. It's a lot of quick plays. So they stack Restrepo and Rockside to the end zone. He goes. I know some of y'all may not like the skipping, but I mean, kind of is what it is. I'm trying to let it play out, but 
It's a lot of similar type plays. It's, uh, not really seeing a lot of, you know. Okay. Not really seeing too too many uh differences in the routes and stuff like that. see some some route work some contested catches some one hand catches some ankles took him yeah oh there we go that was a dime too oh yeah in traffic sheesh that was, that was a plus for him and uh, and the quarterback. Ooh, he launched that. Wow. Good job. Good job. I like that. He kind of put it. The quarterback kind of put it in an odd place, but he he adjusted pretty well. Second and ten. Van Dyke over the middle. That's a good shot to Rambo. The Hurricanes. First and ten. Van Dyke's gonna take a shot deep. Look at him. Wow. Josh Hayes on the coverage, and Van Dyke puts that right on the Oklahoma transfer. Mandy Alonzo there on the tackle. Gotten so much man-to-man -man coverage on first down, or one-on-one -on, -one on the outside. And he got two in. Man, I like it. Uh, another, another quick pass. I don't really see a, this is just just me, but I don't really see a lot of versatility there. Um, I ain't gonna discredit him. Like he did his thing. Seventy nine catches, a thousand, eleven hundred yards, seven touchdowns. You know, you put up some good numbers. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna speak negatively about him, but it's, just, it, it's it's a lot more that I want to see. You know. Nice. He got some good plays. Definitely, he do have some good plays in, in, in his tape. Wow, the cornerback slowed down. He was in a solid position. Oh, he moved out the way. He literally moved out the way. Second to drive, and he gets the call running to the left side. Again, what's going on here? That's the book on NC State. Harley comes in motion. What? Tyler Van Dyke played well in the first half. Going deep down the uh oh, cut the burners on. Oh, okay. Are we going in here? Y'all let me know what y'all thoughts are. Uh, he's he's going to have to put that work in, man. You know, to uh, not only uh, make the roster, but stay on the roster. Uh, it's, I mean, it's, it's potential there. You know, just got to see if, uh, I don't know, how, how it pans and plays out, man. Uh, but y'all let me know what y'all think. Uh, appreciate y'all for watching. Hit the like button for me. Subscribe. Stay tuned. Stay blessed.